city of Lipa. It is the largest city in Batangas. After a two hour ride from Manila, we are going to unwind and explore the exciting countryside of Lipa City. We arrived just about in time before the sunset. We stayed here at Rose Villa Resort, just about near the city proper. It is a very relaxing vibe with their large pool and a modern tropical structure that truly provides calmness and peace that you are looking from a vacation. Time to go to our intended destination here in Lipa, a famous barn I saw on Instagram. The name of the place is the Old Grove Farmstead located in Barangay Ludlod, just about near the Star Expressway. The scenery of the place is definitely stunning. You will see different kinds of buildings like a windmill, a large barn, and a man-made pond. It is truly a countryside experience like no other. There are also livestock from ducks to sheep and some different kinds of birds. The farmstead is truly a beauty, with structures you rarely find here in the Philippines. took our late lunch in their homey restaurant. They served us about a bunch of everything. The restaurant is definitely filled with cool stuff, like the wooden antique chessboard, an old style bookshelves, and just about outside is a well that completes the feel of a country barn. And since they also have coffee produce here, for sure, we're gonna bring some home. There's still so many things I want to see in Batangas. Exploring the pie in a few days doesn't give the province enough to show its true form glory. From its mountains, historic infrastructure, farm, waterfalls, and resort that will make you go back here in this lovely city. I'm also not forgetting the delicacies that inhibit this land. Given that it's just hours away from Manila, I'm expecting that coming back here won't be that long. But for now, I love what the past city has shown. From this lovely farm and beautiful resort, I'm definitely excited for another chapter of adventure here in the city. 